Hey guys, welcome back to more Crisis. Captain Audi, report to CNC. Ain't you the spec ops guy who went inside that thing? You were there, shit. I didn't think anyone made it out alive. Shit, look at me when I when I when you talk to me. Shit. Armory's back the other way and to your right, sir. Alright. Shit, these figures can't be right. We're not equipped to deal with this. You looking for the armory? Down the corridor, take a right. They say shit a lot. I mean like a lot. Hey, what are you guys looking at? You're nomad, right? Yeah. Great job out there, Lieutenant. You put some of our best pilots to shame. Well, fuck you. I don't know why I said fuck you, but whatever. I heard what you did for Keegan's men. I can't believe they never made it out. What? Whatever's wrong with his arms. I don't know, it just- it feels like a completely different tone of a game than it was at the, in the first, like... Fucking three hours or whatever. Where it is, you guys were inside that sphere. Man, those nano suits are something else. They keep talking yeah, to me. What's the problem, sir? Some kind of accumulator. Never seen anything like it. How he got it working is anyone's guess. Hey, how can you see me? I'm cloaked. Nomad, you made it. Hey, Nomad. You alright, mate? I've still got no idea how you rig these wrecks of us. We don't understand it either. The firing mechanism is quite complex. It would take us weeks to reverse engineer it, yet you managed to modify them in the field. You even integrated the power source with your nano suit. Remarkable. Yes, I'm a natural. To put it mildly. Okay, your suit should be fully operational with a few minor enhancements. I've diverted extra power to your hydro thrusters as requested. You're good to go, Major. Dr. Gillespie, I need to run some tests on Nomad's nano suit. I was told you'd be able to help. Certainly. Take a seat, Lieutenant. We're anxious to retrieve the environmental data from your suit's recording unit. <laughs> I'm good as cloak here. Where, where'd that, where'd he go? He's not on the seat. Hey, boss. Where you going? I'm gonna finish this. I reckon nuking the entire island is about as final as it gets. What Admiral Morrison does is not my concern. This nuke won't even scratch the surface. Prophet, wait! So, what can I do for you, Doctor? I've identified a signal pattern used by these creatures when they recharge. I think it makes them susceptible to an energy overload. Is there any way to transmit one of their signals via the nanosuit? Shouldn't be a problem. Let me see what I can do. What if I need to alter the frequency remotely? Fairly straightforward. You can send signals from any computer with a wireless connection. That should leave you room to experiment. But what exactly are you guys doing to me? If my theory is correct, you'll be a walking weapon to fight these things. And if your theory's wrong? Then we better pray Morrison knows what he's doing. Dr. Rosenthal, report to the bridge. Dr. Rosenthal to the bridge immediately. You shouldn't keep the Admiral waiting, Doctor. I can finish up here. Okay. Nomad, meet me up at the bridge as soon as you're ready. Pretty girl. Not many of those in my field. If I were ten years younger, I'd... Ah, there she is. Put her on the rack over there. Yep. Prototype tag cannon designed to be used in conjunction with the nanos. We're still experimenting. It hasn't even been field tested. It fires a projectile tactical nuke. Works like a grenade launcher, but with a lot more bang for your buck. Whatever will they think of next? Can I try it out? <laughs> no. Well, I think we're done here, Lieutenant. I'll leave it to Dr. Rosenthal to fine-tune your transmitter. Thanks, Doc. No problem. You better get up to the bridge. The Admiral isn't known for his patience. Nomad! Yeah? If you see Helena, can you tell her... Uh, it doesn't matter. Okay. I'm, I'm good with that. Go easy on that thing. It's volatile. Relax, I know what I'm doing. Man, this is Admiral Morrison. A few moments ago, I received authorization from the President to launch a limited nuclear strike against the hostiles on the island. 
Obviously, the decision to use nuclear force is a very serious one. We are still unsure of the exact nature of our opposition. But based on intel gathered by our special ops team, we believe our planet is facing an imminent and very real threat. Whatever happens in the next few minutes, I know that each one of you will perform your duty with honor and professionalism. Now I need you all to report to your battle stations and brace for impact. Let's take the fight to the boys. Yeah, I beat him here. Major Barnes, this is Admiral Morris. Put that beat on down immediately. You got him, Major Barnes! What is he doing? Sir, should I scramble an intercept? Let him go. Crazy bastard What's just up? signed his own death warrant. About time, Lieutenant. We're almost ready to launch. What's the problem, That sir? Major of yours just went AWOL. Raided the armory, took a VTOL, and headed back to the island. Prophet's going back there? Can I help you? You have to delay the launch. He made his choice, Lieutenant. Admiral, I'm begging you to reconsider. It's too much of a risk. What if this is exactly what they want? What if we're playing into their hands? I don't have time for what ifs, Doctor. The Pentagon has authorized the use of nuclear force. I have my orders. Constitution Command, this is Marauder 1. We've got lock. Approaching critical range. Over. You got a problem? Ah, Marauder 1. Stand by. We're ready, sir. What if you're wrong, Admiral? Can you live with the consequences? Proceed with the launch. Aye, aye, sir. Marauder 1, this is Constitution Command. That's a green light. Deliver the payload. Over. I hope you're right about this. You, me, and the rest of the planet. What? Cool, okay. Well, I guess uh, he's just gonna wave his arms there. And a crowbar. Ooh, a goss. Nice. Alright, well. We don't get a we don't get basically anything, but we got two pistols, so that's okay. I can now ramble the fuck out of this game. Oh boy. We were wrong! We were wrong the entire time. Alright, let's put a laser pointer on this thing. Alright. Alright, what's this? Oh, I can just only pick up the box. So it gives you a couple weapons. Huh. People keep being dead. Oh shit.
Well, I'm glad I helped, guys. I'm going back inside later. Oh, okay. All right, no, I don't get anything else interesting for this. Unfortunately, whenever you use the red dot sight, it seems, you get this, this really long reload animation. I can't cancel out of it. Uh, I can try and go to iron sights, but except I'm going to just plan on dying right now. Okay. Well. Uh, so yeah, the iron sights don't do shit either. It's, you might as well have the accuracy of this thing. Oh, look, cool. I, I didn't have to do anything with it. I mean, I feel really inaccurate. I can't have crap one hitting me, so I'm gonna try and go into armor mode whenever I feel like I'm in danger. Like this, like right now. No, I, I kind of think I want the, the missile launcher instead. There are a lot of them. What do you say? There's like 12 of them? I'm kind of like long ranging these guys. I have to kind of point my laser thing towards it. Oh, cool, I killed him. <laughs> That's the fun part. I might, I, you know, I might as well just have speed out. I can have, like, both of this is locking on him. Come on. Come on. Oh, for God's sake, come on. There we go. Look at that. It's like it just came out of nowhere. Good thing that the Goss Rifle is just so fucking awesome. Now, I, I would say this is like the first time I've ever actually felt like the armor mode was actually really useful right now. I just really hate this red dot sight. But I just keep using it. And I can't stop. Alright, ooh, more missile launchers, nice. I'll hold you to that when I come back. Okay, you're not holding the flight deck. You just came down with me. All right. You've already failed your mission, sir. Hey, cool. I can actually punch him if I do it like outside. Eh, doesn't actually do anything. All right, let's go, guys. No, man. I'm in the lab with Helena. Where are you? There's a breach in the hull. I'm heading down to the reactor room. I'm always in trouble. Oh, good one, Nomad. You're a funny guy. That's why I kill you last. Alright, well, I don't think I really want anything else from this dude, so... I mean, I kind of like having the minigun ammo. Uh... Okay, I'm like, am I not supposed to go this way? Fuck! Fuck ship, come on! Keep it together. It's only a nuke, how hard can it be? Is there a nuclear reactor? Oh, 
Are you gonna... Okay, cool. You looked at the screen and it opened. Good job. 10 out of 10. IGN. Uh-oh. I don't like the... sound of that. Or maybe I do. should be near the circuit breaker now. The red radiation warning light will be flashing next to it. <laughs> Just ignore it. Okay, that should do it. Great. Broad arms are now open. Head over to the reactor room and initiate the scram sequence. Of course, the scram sequence. That, that's exactly what I was thinking. The scram sequence. I wonder if this is actually nuclear terminology. So this is like the utility part of, of uh, Crisis, where I, 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 I dick around with uh, nuclear reactors and shit. Because apparently I'm, I'm, I'm not only a pilot, I'm also a nuclear physicist. Oh look, I'm, I'm, I seriously, Gordon Freeman, I'm crawling through vents and shit. That's fucking wonderful. All right. Well then. Okay, I'm in the reactor room. What next? Hit the red button. Scrap sequence initiated. Good work, Nomad. The control rod should bottom now. Oh no, two of them did not bottom. I kind of just made the eh, eh, eh noise. I thought I could bottom the fucking core reactor. Oh, I have to maximum strength it down. Oh, okay. Oh, I'll do. I'll do that. I, this is faster than fucking building it up again. All right. Uh, all right. Yes, sir. Fucking hell, I have to wait for my, my, my shit to recharge. Cause I, I have to do- I have to fucking do it with the maximum, uh, strength. It's ridiculous. Alright, go down. Well then. I guess we'll just, uh, you know, sit here and file some TPS reports. Throw a chair. Oh, I'm Steve Ballmer. You don't know he has a reputation for throwing chairs. Little known fact, you guys learned something from my let's play. Haha, <laughs> made you learn when it's Christmas holiday. Oh. Ah, okay. So apparently I didn't have to stand there, I just realized. I apparently could have just done it all in one go with strength on. Okay, because they go down by themselves. Well, I learned my, an important, valuable lesson today. Nice job pushing those rods down, boy. But I need you up on deck. We got another wave of hostiles inbound. Get up here! I'll just go over here. I love speed. Wait, am I actually supposed to go down there? No, I assume it's actually this way. Or maybe not, I don't know. Is he 
going down with the ship or what? Take a fucking gun. Asswipe. Whatever. The blast doors unlocked, Lieutenant. Take the ammo elevator. Oh, you. Wait. I was, I was just about to ask him, like, is something wrong with him? Hey. Come on out. You know, maybe these guys are as dumb as Koreans. Oh, whoa. Wait. Nope. Okay, so apparently whenever I, uh... ...have issues with them, I all I have to do is... Uh, wave the mouse around wildly. That would be the first thing I was planning on doing. I think he handled them. Oh no, maybe he didn't. I like how Korean strategies work here. I think the aliens were Koreans all along. You guys good? Or you want me to help you out? No, I guess not. I'll just Michael Bay this motherfucker. Hey, cool. They left some goss ammo for me. Nice. I kind of can just like no scope them. Watch me do this 360 wall wall no scope. Uh oh shit. It's a cloak scope. <laughs> yeah, I can just I can just leave. Fuck that. Fuck those aliens. Da na 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 oh. It's USS already sinking. Cause I saw the water on that thing. You can't hide it from me, Crisis Engine. Alright, well. That's officially now boring to look at. My attention as a gamer has been expended. Okay, now the ship's gone. All hands, abandon ship! Ah! Abandon ship! Nomad, they're swarming the flight deck! You have to get up here now! Flying took place safe. I'll get up there. I need to make a stop first. Morrison, I'm heading to the lab to pick up that TAC cannon. Make it quick, Lieutenant. Need you out on deck. There's something lucky. Something big. Uh oh. Defensive cloak, go. Uh hi. I'm I'm kinda stuck here. What the hell? So apparently the aliens have now fucked me because I'm stuck <laughs> I'm stuck in the wall here. Yeah, this is a good place to end it as any. So we'll see you next time when I de-stuck de-stuck de myself. I'll see you later. Bye.